Hi, I'm Erin Brothers, Director of Music Ministry at Dixon United Methodist Church. And I'm spent. My kid is crying because he thinks I put his underwear on backwards. As I've addressed before, I'm always tired. I feel like I'm trying hard to keep my priorities in check, but there's always backwards underwear, or one more homework assignment, or one more fit about screen time, or one more personal issue just to seal the deal. Then I could just crawl back into my cozy bed with cute Christmas-themed flannel sheets and wait for the day to start over. I know I'm not the only one feeling this way, or worse. So what do we have left to give God if we can't even care for ourselves? In Mark 6, verses 35 through 38, after a long day of teaching, Jesus and the disciples felt spent too. Late in the day, his disciples came to him and said, This is an isolated place and it's already late in the day. Send them away so they can go to the surrounding countryside and villages and buy something to eat for themselves. He replied, You give them something to eat. But they said to him, should we go off and buy bread worth almost eight months' pay and give it to them to eat? He said to them, How much bread do you have? Take a look. After checking, they said, Five loaves of bread and two fish. Sure, Jesus. Let's see what you do for about a gazillion people with five loaves of bread and two fish, because that's all we've got. And you know the rest of the story. Every person in the crowd of a gazillion was fed until they were full, and there were still baskets left over. We come to Jesus sometimes energetic with all of ourselves to give, but even when we come to him spent, greasy-haired, exhausted, emotionally stretched to the limit, he finds a way to take what we have, even in the smallest amounts, and multiply it into something he can use to restore us and still feed others. So bring Jesus what you have. Riches or rags, you are an important part of God's ministry here. And if for some reason you just can't deal with your underwear being backwards, it's entirely possible God will give you what you truly need. Rest.